Dionne Warwick hasn't forgotten about Taylor Swift's long-lost scarf. The five-time Grammy winner reiterated her earlier pledge to retrieve the missing accessory, widely speculated to be in the possession of actor Jake Gyllenhaal, whom Swift once stated, in an appearance on The Late Show with Stephen Colbert this week. When Colbert asked Warwick if Gyllenhaal had ever responded to her tweet urging him to return the scarf, Warwick said she hadn't heard from him or Swift either, but that she was nonetheless planning to touch base. Not one word from him or her yet, she said. I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna give her a call. I am, to find out if she got her scarf. If she didn't, she added, I'm gonna find Jake. Watch Dion Warwick on The Late Show with Stephen Colbert below. The scarf became the subject of online discourse in November, when Swift released her re-recorded album Red, Taylor's version. The new release featured a 10-minute version of her 2012 song All Too Well, with an accompanying short film. For years, fans have speculated that All Too Well was inspired by Swift's brief relationship with Gyllenhaal. The track features the lyrics, I left my scarf there at your sister's house slash and you've still got it in your drawer even now. Days after the release of Red, Taylor's version, Warwick weighed in on the scarf conversation. If that young man has Taylor's scarf he should return it, she wrote on Twitter. Moments later, she added, it does not belong to you. Box it up and I will pay the cost of postage, Jake. Jillian Hall, for his part, has never publicly commented on his alleged ties to the scarf. Meanwhile, Warwick has said that she'd love to collaborate with Swift in the future. I think Taylor has a wonderful voice, she said in a Twitter Q&A with Billboard last year. She writes incredible music, and it'd be wonderful of her to write for me something to sing with her.